Hey! <laughs> What's going on, folks? Welcome to the Cash Creek Club. The Check Cash, it out. The Cash man. Creek Club Podcast Edition Web Series. Is that what that is? That's what it is. <laughs> Today. Did you just make that up? I, I did. That's very good. And on our first debut episode here, episode numero uno. Uno. Our special guest is Jackson Forrest. Imagine he'll be, that. He'll be here doing some... <laughs> our guinea pig. Our guinea pig, that's <laughs> right. He's going to be doing some singing for you. And uh, we'll also be drawing the the winner So uh, in our... What the heck was that anyway? It's a giveaway of the uh, guitar string jewelry. The guitar string jewelry, that's right. That's right. So roll the intro. <laughs> That's cool. Hey, yeah. You like that? <laughs> yeah. Monty? Yeah, man. I'm making sure this thing is still looking good here. Looks good from here. Sounds great from my yeah, house. Yeah. All right. <laughs> so, uh, what we, we we got some things to tell these folks, right? Some business to take care of before we, we get too deep. We always have lots of things to tell y'all. Because, right. you know, most of you probably won't care about it, but, you know. Well, there's a lot of what stuff to talk it? about, folks. And we, we have got a whole bunch of little things that we're going to be doing. Like, we're going to have something called the Alabama Minute, where I kind of give you an update on what went on the last weekend um, out with those guys. We're going to have the Squatch Report. The Squatch Report. I love it. The Squatch Report. <laughs> Latest in all of Squatching News. That's and, not my recent dance video, right? No, no, no. That's okay. not. And then um, we're also going to have just, you know, we're, we're going to be talking about current events. Ooh. Yeah, it could, it could get ugly. That could get ugly. Grumpy old guy stuff messy. on yet. Thank goodness we got a, a, a young dude here with us today who can give us that, that side of things. But well, first, perspective. let's do the Alabama Minute. <laughs> oh, wait, I don't know how much of the music we can use. This last weekend, we were in Salt Lake City. And um, Grand Junction, Grand Junction, Colorado, did a show with Chris Jansen, Rodney Atkins, and they all were awful. It just sounded terrible until Alabama came out. Then it was awesome. What are you laughing at? Of course. <laughs> no, but the thing I don't that, think Chris and Rodney are going to be too appreciative. Yeah, about that. they will never get them on here. Yeah, yeah. The thing that sucked though was the twenty-eight hour bus trip out there. And the 24-hour bus trip back. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know, Jason and Steve, they get a little gamey. Ooh. Yeah. Gamey, gamey <laughs> barn. Ga- bar- Barney gamey. Yeah. Ooh. Pretty bad. Um, it's Mr. Slate now, too, right? It is Mr. Slate. Pepper Mr. has become... And Pepper, Mr. Slate. He gets really gamey and that shirt comes off and he gets in, he gets into the fireball. The steel, baby. Yeah, it's 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 it's, it's, it's not pretty. Um, but we made it, we survived, and this week is fan appreciation week or fad days in Fort Payne, Alabama. Um, Teddy will have a show Thursday. Jeff has a show Friday. Saturday is the concert, and then Randy does a thing on Sunday, Fandemonium at the Farm. A lot of fun. So if you're down in Fort Payne, Alabama, come on down. Which a lot of our folks are going to be there. A lot of our folks are going. They're there right now. They are. Yeah. They're whooping it up. They're, they're, they're nuts, Money. They are. They are absolutely They might be crazy. locked up already. Yeah. I know that, you know, the what what they call themselves the Cash Creek, is it ladies or girls or... I think it's girls. The girls, the Cass Creek girls. Watch out, yeah. watch out, Fort Payne. <laughs> uh, but that's it for the Alabama. Man. Hey, I almost had my Ed McMahon there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm working on it. I'll get this down. Ed McMahon. Yeah. <laughs> hey, that's better. I I like that. That's closer. I like that. If that's my job. I'm just gonna sit here. <laughs> <laughs> Doing great, Kimo. Doing great. Yeah. Keep it up. It's funny, you know, you have all these ideas and stuff, and of course we'll dial things in as it goes on. And everything that we don't like about this episode, we'll 
we'll edit out. Of. Yeah, which means there'll be two new people here yeah. next time. <laughs> we have full edit capability because this yeah. is not live. Yeah, this is not live. We know better than to do those things now. Yeah. Especially um, when Blaylock gets here. Can't, right. You cannot have him live. No. no Bad he, things happen. You, you, you can't even contain him. You know how some people say you can't stop him, you can only hope to contain him. You can't even contain Blaylock. There's no containing the Blaylock, man. I mean, he can't be stopped. He's a force to be reckoned with. You'll it's never just, know. He'll, he'll, he'll it's pull a natural out, disaster. He'll pull out the BA and the BD just like that. He yank his shirt off. We've seen it happen. Man. He'll go leaping lizards and all of a sudden, <laughs> bam, it comes out. It's scary. <laughs> it is scary, you know. Scarred my youth. Which re- re- reminds me, wasn't Godzilla awesome? Oh, <laughs> the best dude movie ever. <laughs> Babes will not like that movie. It is total guy flick. And it's so awesome. Because we grew up watching the, you know, the, the original Godzillas with the rubber suit dudes running around smashing up their little sets. And yeah. out there in Japan, they made that. And we went goo-goo over that. But this new one, oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. King of the monsters. It's incredible. Fantastic. We encourage everybody to go see it. Absolutely. At least the dudes. And we saw it in the 4XD. That's right. And it was a ride. If you've Beat never, us up, man. If, if you've never been to a 4XD oh movie, I mean, it... It just beats the heck out it of you. It does, because the seats move, and they spray you with water, and you got wind blowing at you. It's nuts. Yeah, and the seats move. I, I mean, like, you know, when Ro- Rodan got stabbed, spoiler alert, there's this thing that came through the back of your seat and it actually hits you in the back. I yeah. think it killed a couple folks. I'm not I don't sure. know. But Jackson was really excited to see the Elton John movie there. He, he was, wasn't yeah, he? Yeah, he sure was. He was, was it water spraying him? May not have been. <laughs> we don't know yet. The tests haven't come back. We'll have to ask him how that experience was. <laughs> okay. But I've heard great things about that flick, actually. Yeah. Really, yeah. really good things. <laughs> hey, we're going to take a quick break. We'll show you this little cool thing, whatever it is. We don't know what it's going to be yet. But something's going to roll right after this. And when we come back, Jackson Forrest will be right here. Yes, he will. No, he'll be right here. I'm going to be right there. He'll be right there. Yes. It's your friendly neighborhood bass player here to tell you about our Cash Creek Club live show. It's happening August 7th. That's a Wednesday night. 6 o'clock. Music City Bar and Grill. That's down in Music Valley. Look it up. You'll be there. And we're back. We're back. <laughs> Our special guest, Mr. Jackson Forrest, is here. Man, the beard is looking good. Thank you. The beard Thank came you. real strong. The hair looks good, too. Look what happens when you graduate high school, have a record out, and you're getting all squatched up. He can go to jail <laughs> now. <Stop>. Yeah. <laughs> Let's hope that doesn't happen anytime soon. This is Jackson's album, his EP, Seven Songs. Just all, the t- just the tip of the iceberg. All, all written by. You. So, what's the inspiration on this stuff, buddy? Um, let me let hey let me take it track by track, and you tell me. Okay. How much time do we have? Falling for you. Um, well. When you like a girl, you um, We're you fall for. Uh, Sorry, so we don't we can't relate. Yeah, oh, yeah. Okay. And it's Next. not like a girl. It's it's like insert name here. We want the du- dirt. We want the dish. We want the seedy underbelly. I don't know what that means. Who was it that you wrote the song for? Who was it? Ooh, we'll we can't divulge that information. I don't feel comfortable saying that. Ever. Okay. That's that's the opening song in here. The next one, Throw the World Away. We'd like to do that. Mm. Uh, what's that about? Well, I was in choir class one day, and um, we were building a globe, and <laughs> someone broke class? it. Yeah, in choir class. <laughs> is, yeah. is this a true story? Yeah, this is a true story. This is awesome. The things that happen at private choir. school. Yeah, yeah. Um, so we're building a globe. Well, anyway, someone breaks it, and then someone said, oh, you just throw the world away. And then the teacher looked at me and said, hey, Jackson, you write songs. You should write a song about that. And you did it. So I wrote a song about it. And I think it's my favorite one on there. It's got that smooth kind of feel to it. 
Mm-hmm. And then, of course, your breakout single, the one that had you signing the autographs and the girls all screaming and going crazy, was I Don't Write Love Songs, which is a lie. Yes. Because you, know, yes. you do. I. But tell me yes. about that song, I Don't Write Just Love won't. Songs. Tell, tell them about that song, I Don't Write Love Songs. Um, well, it's a love song about not writing love songs. Which, like you said, is a lie. And that's <laughs> which, by the way, he will be performing later. Yes, and that's basically all there is to it. Okay. Mostly crazy. Uh, I know who that one's about. Which we'll we won't talk about that one. <laughs> Time to move on. I know who that one's about too. Uh, and the right person. That's that's the one. You got to tell that story about your brother on when he listened to the right person. Yes, um, my brother, who is a grown man, is um, he's old actually. <laughs> He texted me He's out of nowhere. Oh, <laughs> bursitis is kicking in. Yeah, and just um, he asked if I wrote that song, and I said yes. And he said I sounded like a grown man, and that I made him cry. So he had to text me to tell me that he was crying while listening to my song. But the first thing he texted was all caps. What did it say? Who hurt you? <laughs> yeah, I forgot about that part. It is, it is a wonderful song, son. I'm so proud of you. I'm so proud of this record here. You're going to hear him um, doing... Which one are you going to do for us today? Uh, I don't write love songs. Marty and I are going to play along with you, if you don't mind. Maybe a little. Okay, yeah, we won't. Yeah, good, because I don't know it. Okay, cool. I might feel a little good. <laughs> <know>. <laughs> I could vamp on some really cool stuff on it, though. You can just beatbox. Hey, do we have time to include him in our Squatch Report this week? Yes. So this week, over in eastern Tennessee. East Tennessee? Ten- east Tennessee Bigfoot had this up. Some dude was driving along over by the uh, garbage cans at in the state park there. He was kind of far out, but his headlights can't came upon. How far out was he smoking something funny? Came upon the old Squatch, standing there by the... And he said that it shielded its eyes from the light and took off into the woods. He said never got down on all fours. That was this week. Really? Yes. Hmm. Yeah. That's true. Our studio audience is getting out of control here. <laughs> we don't lie at all on this show. We don't have yes. a studio audience here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, while you're here, before oh. you sing, do we have time to do this before the next break? Oh, yeah, oh, we, yeah, we got all kinds of time. As you, if you don't mind, drawing the name for the winner of the uh, guitar string jewelry. We have the guitar string jewelry for, for the, the girls or the koozie. Oh, the koozie for the boys. That's for the right. dudes. The yeah. dudes. Yeah. Totally random. Wait, wait, there's somebody coming running up out of the audience. How is that person doing? We don't have an audience here. Oh, hey! Oh, hey! Oh! Hey. oh. oh. <laughs> Who, who's the Bogarten on the name here? The winner is Karina... Karina Kufos. Hey! Corey, you won! Is that what that says? I, I know Karina Kufos. You do? I do. Okay. Yes. So, Karina Kufos, you need to direct message us either at Facebook or Twitter um, with your social security. Bracelet. Your um, social security. Yeah, and uh, <laughs> things you like to do. No, you, you don't want to mess. You know, you don't want to make her angry because her husband's a power lifter. Yeah, but I, I'm and a lot uh, to lift. He could lift you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, never right mind. on out the window. No, <laughs> forget Yay. what I said. Yay, Yay Corey! Corey. The winner, the winner, and it's not fixed because you can see these are all different. Shh. <laughs> <laughs> you can't see. see? Can you see that over there? I can't see it. I can't see it. Where do you see that? Does that say Karina Kufos? It should. Very cool. That's your winner. Yeah. All right. Can you see it? Oh, wait, you're the microphone. <laughs> oh, my gosh. He's been up too long. We'll be back. See with what a happens when you ride 28 hours on a bus. We'll be back with a live performance from Jackson Forrest doing I Don't Write Love Songs. Next. My one temptation, the one I can't refuse. I want an only weakness. Is you. If you ever tell me that I have to give you up, it's just gonna kill me. Cause I can't live without your love. 
Ladies and gentlemen, Jackson Forrest. I've sat by the ocean, I've heard church bells ring. In my time, I've seen some beautiful things, but it never compares to when I look in your eyes. And every minute spent with you just seems to fly by. I don't write love songs, babe, but I got one for you, so you know how I feel. When you do what you do You drive me crazy, girl You don't even try It breaks my heart When you say goodbye I'm not one for being The romantic kind but whenever we touch, I need a rewind You know it's not a secret that I think that you're great I can't wait to see what kind of life we'll create I don't write love songs, babe But I got one for you So you know how I feel When you do what you do You drive me crazy See, girl, you don't even try It breaks my heart when you say goodbye There's a sweet zone that you put in my heart I know you can hear it too It keeps on playing even when we're apart So here goes me trying something new Here's your love song, babe It's all about you So you know how I feel When you do what you do You drive me crazy, girl You don't even try It breaks my heart When you say goodbye Here's your love song, babe It's all about you So you know how I feel when you do what you do You drive me crazy, girl You don't even try It breaks my heart When you say goodbye Jack, that was awesome, dude. Thank you. Thank you. Jackson Forrest. Here's the CD. Now, how can they get the CD? Because um, everybody should have a CD. Even if you've got the download, you should get the CD. Well, you can get the CD on cashcreekband.com. So, how does that yeah. work? Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. He's got some inside. Hacked into our stuff. I tell you, he's he's... He's moving some muscle. Dang. Congratulations, right. Kufos. Karina Kufos, our winner. Yeah. Should be wearing that all around Napa. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah Napa girl. Cool. We're going to be doing a drawing every week, by the way. We didn't tell them that. We did not. I didn't. I mean, not that. every week, but every podcast. So every podcast. If, if you didn't win this time, <clears throat> don't worry. Because Karina won't be in the next one. Oh, no. You. Oh. <laughs> You can only win one time here, you buddy. See that? One winner. One winner per household. Wow. And what's this? And then, <laughs> what do you think of that? I have no comment for that. I'm going to leave the screen for a moment. Wow. I can't believe you did that. Hey. Is that your... No. No, he's not. You're from the loins. So if you... No, he's not. <laughs> yes, you're from... You're from the loin. You're from the loin of that. Oh, that's awesome. 
So, hey, thanks for sticking with us till the end of the first Cash Creek Club podcast. That's right. Appreciate Jackson Forrest being here, our guinea pig. Way to go, Jack. Yeah, buddy. Thank yeah. You. Tell keep, all your friends, subscribe to this here channel so that you can uh, keep up with Future guests to include some management people, some heavy hitters. Heidi Newfield. Yeah, baby. Yeah, from Santa Rosa and uh, of, of Johnny and June fame. That's right. And long history of between us yeah most yeah. Know, know about we've known Heidi since she was 13 and she could sing just like that at 13 yeah yeah and um, I think I'm gonna get on John Michael's bus and ambush him perfect we got a show together on the 27th perfect come in there with the camera crew gotta get you gotta get John Michael yeah on. more to come though because of your history with him yeah goes goes way back thanks Jack what about our shirts? You had something to talk about our shirts? What about our shirts? I don't know. Oh, what was I going to say about our shirts? We still got a lot of them. We do. And all because of Wyant Enterprises. That's the name Wyatt. that I was yes. just trying to grab. <laughs> Wyant Enterprises. Let me give their information. <laughs> that's all you get. That's all you get. That's, that's all you need. Wyant Enterprises. You look them up. You can oh. look them up. Yeah, hey, I think our next giveaway is going to be the Cash Creek Crew shirt. There's only oh. one. There's, yeah. there's only one. You folks have seen. Oh, shoot. What was that? Was that small? I don't know. Word? You're wasting time here, man. Get back oh. in the shot. Come on. You've all seen these. Oh, wait. No, this is a different one. This is a one of a kind. Show them that, buddy. Oh, this is the. Uh... Yep, the Cash Creek Crew. One size fits one all. One size fits all. That's it. So one dude size, or babe, whatever. All of you. But it's got the Cash Creek on the sleeve. So special. That'll be on the next podcast. Keyboard. That's the next one. Right. There's only one. And now it's video time with Monty. Yay! This week we have my one and only weakness. Ooh. Recently nominated for the Josie Music Awards 2019 Video of the Year. Here we go. Gave up those cowboy killers Cause you asked me to not because the Surgeon General said they ain't good for you. They were just a habit, but you're what I need. Your arms are the only thing that have a hold on me. Sometimes I wake up in the night Craving something sweet But it's not in the kitchen Oh, it's lying next to me You're my one temptation The one I can't refuse My one and only I want
We did it. Where's our fanfare? Yay. Roll, roll them closing credits. We'll see you guys next time. <laughs>